First ingredient is a russer? Caught one. Caught another one. I've got three of them. That should be enough. Now it's time to get a bulwark? That should be plenty for a hearty meal. <laughs> I've collected all the ingredients Kent needs. Time to head back. Everything I need. Good. Let's. Oh, what's happening? I have a bad feeling about this. Now it seems that the Kala heart is missing. How is this possible? How could the Kala heart have disappeared from under our noses? The token, you say? Yes, of course I have it. Look, it is right here. You weren't suggesting that the High Priestess, the Chief Hunter, and I conspired to steal the heart, are you? That's ridiculous. Besides, we couldn't have done it with so many people around. Don't just stand there. Start investigating. We mustn't let the thief get away. Perhaps I should check out the Kalar Terminal. Maybe I'll find something there. What is this? Or... There's another one here. I've never seen these before. Wait, these spores are contaminated with Kala. Maybe Gila can help me understand this. I can't believe it! The heart is actually missing? I really shouldn't have jinxed it. You found spores contaminated with Kalar? You know, they look familiar. <gasps> I remember now. These come from the Kaladin tribe. The Kaladanians? Ha! <laughs> I should have known. The Kaladanians are the natives who inhabit the Forest of Ancients. They rarely interact with us, but... I'm sure these spores come from the forest. They use the spores in religious rituals to induce a trance-like state. They believe it brings them closer to their goddess. These spores are used by the Caledonians in religious rituals to induce a trance-like state. They believe it brings them closer to their goddess. But how could they have removed the heart without the three tokens? Could it... Wait! I remember being told of a legend by the old head priestess. She said the Kaladin priests had a special technique to convert the heart into a corporeal form. Maybe that's how the thief did it. I knew those Kaladins wouldn't stay hidden in their woods forever. We must inform the village elder. If those forest-bound savages are the culprits, we'll have no choice but to go to war.
Are you going to the Forest of Ancients? I'm ready to accompany you. Don't worry. If the heart is really there, I should be able to locate it. I'll just need some time. So, you're looking for a capable helper. I do have someone in mind. He's pretty reliable. He may be a Cheeburb, but he's actually just as strong as you are. Don't worry, you'll get it once you see him. You can try- This is the helper I told you about. Pleasure to meet you, Light Red. As you can see, I'm a Cheeburb warrior. I may be different from the rest, but I'm a Cheeburb through and through. My friend wants to take a trip to the Forest of Ancients. To prevent, uh... The Forest of Ancients? That's a dangerous place. But I'd do anything to keep us out of a war. After all, no one knows the vileness of war better than a warrior. You should be aware that taking the life of a conscious being with a soul is far crueler than killing monsters. We'll head out as soon as you're ready. This is your first adventure to so distant a place, right? I do believe in your capabilities, but you should still visit gazers. Besides, I know that no hunter can pass up the chance to upgrade their weapon. So, you are the youngster who took down the Blood Gorg? You must have extraordinary skills to best a creature like that on your first hunt. You can't keep using that old weapon of yours. Vider I can forge your weapons to improve their attributes and unlock new forms. You'll see that we artisans are as serious about our work as you hunters. Now that we're done with your weapon, let's start on your armor. Whether you're going to the Forest of Ancients, the Volnar Valley, or anywhere beyond Viterin, you'll need a set of good armor to protect yourself from dangerous beasts. Come with me, and I'll show you how to forge armor. Looks like you're ready to go. Be Don't expect to be welcomed by the Forest of Ancients. The Caledanians hold a far deeper grudge than we do. Not to mention the conflicts in our beliefs. But don't worry. I know an adventurer named Skady. She has lived in the forest for years. She knows everything about the place. If you run into any trouble, you can ask her for help. Skady's been quite active in the area near Viderin of late. Her camp should be easy to find, but you may find her a bit odd in the way she appears and interacts with people. I hope you aren't put off by her uniqueness. There is no time to lose. You must set off immediately. like someone is watching us. But I don't feel anything. I trust a warrior's instincts if I were you. A medium's senses are more reliable. We have the eyes of a Thisbe and the ears of a Russer. Neither a breeze in the leaves nor the rustling of the grass escapes my... 